YouTube, what's going on? Coming to you with another video. I wanted to drop this quick video, you know, kind of explaining a little bit more of the video HT Logistics drop. I believe it was yesterday. Um, about the market, you know, the market going back to normal next year or whatever the case may be, whenever it's gonna go back to normal. You know, I actually got it. I actually got a chance, uh, experience all this. You know, I know what a normal market is. So uh, I seen it. Some of you guys, like I said, some of you guys are coming out here right now. You know, and I get these questions a lot too. Emails, you know, a lot of people trying to uh, come into the game. You know, um, like I said, I believe COVID last year, COVID race was the worst, absolute worst. And if you can base your business, your trucking model off of that, it always doubled, maybe even tripled, you know, what the COVID race was, you will be good. You know, like you said, a lot of people come into this game and uh, thinking this is normal. Yeah, this is definitely not normal. Um, just got I, I really hate people to come in this, you know, this trucking industry and thinking like they're gonna make all this money. You know, it doesn't work like that. I mean, it does work like that. You will make some money, but uh, you got to prepare for you know the worst. And like I said, when COVID did, when COVID hit, like I said, the rates was like at an all-time low. You know, it was it was at a point was at about a dollar fifty. Sometimes even less. I seen 98 cents a mile on a regular. You know, that's crazy. You know, that's when they had all those, uh, you know, them uh, with trucking marches. They had one in Chicago, Texas, uh, was it Jersey, DC. They had all those truck trucking marches. That's real. You can't, like people can't survive off that. You know, um, but some people can, but you know, that's not realistic, you know? So this is why you gotta plan for stuff like that. Also, you know, when the rates are down that low, when I mean, when they're high right now, it gives you the opportunity to always shoot for the high. You understand what I'm saying? Always shoot for the high. Sometimes y'all wonder, you know, especially when I drop that dispatching video, you know, throwing out crazy numbers like that. Why not? You know what I'm saying? Why not throw out a crazy number? That's what I'm talking about. You can't be scared to open your mouth, you know? Um, you're never going to meet these people a day in your life. So, you might feel that a lane pays, for example, you might feel like a lane pays, you know, you're going 300 miles and it pays 900 bucks. Okay, shoot for 1,500 bucks. Why not? You see what I'm saying? Um, you know, you never know. But if you don't start, you know what I'm saying, uh, training yourself to shoot high like that on a regular basis, but when the, when the market goes down like that, you know, you're accustomed to that low rate. You know, you always shoot high. Yeah, you probably won't get that high rate when the market goes down, but at least you try. You see what I'm saying? Um, you gotta develop, and this is, you also gotta develop some type of, you got, I always speak about network. You always ask me about local lanes and stuff like that. You gotta network, you gotta open your mouth. You know, I spoke about this in the last video. You gotta open your mouth, you gotta network, you gotta talk to people, you gotta connect the dots, okay? Or you can get freight for the same rate all year round. Yeah, they do that. Yeah, they definitely do that. You know, even when the market is down, you get the same rate all year round. Yeah, it's out there. You just gotta find it, you know? Um, but yeah, I just wanna drop that quick video, you know, just kinda like explain a little bit more, you know, my two cents where HT drop about the race being, uh, going back to normal, you know, cause I experienced it. See, I got a chance, another thing, I got a chance to experience it while I was leased on, you know? I, you know, I, and I was prepared for when I got my authority, you know, when stuff like that happens. Cause you know, 
I had got, I had my authority when COVID was going on, you know, so I knew not to make no drastic changes in my business, which I didn't grow. I didn't add on no equipment or anything like that. I kind of just stayed the same, kind of figured it out until it kind of went, the race went back up. When the race shot through the roof back in July, that's when I, you know, made the strike. Y'all saw the auction video. Y'all saw when I bought the two trailers. Uh, the other two trailers I bought, the 07s, uh, back in July last year. I think it was July, yeah, it was July last year. You know, I made a move as soon as the race went up. Um, but yeah, that's how, I, that's how I played the game. That's how you gotta play it out. You know, when it comes to, when the race been uh, that crazy like that on COVID time, but you don't make no drastic changes. You know, you just kind of, when races are race down like that, you kind of keep doing the same thing you already was doing. You know, you don't make no moves, don't do none of that. You know, you gotta wait to, to things mellow out so you can figure out your next move. But I just wanna drop that quick video. Make sure y'all sure like, subscribe, and share the video.